Hi, it's Chester Tuckwell at Blue Pecan Computer Training. And in this video, we're going to look at the VBA to copy a workbook from one folder to another folder to, in our situation, a backup folder. Now to start with, I'm going to declare two variables, one for the source folder, a string, because it will contain the path, and the second for the destination folder, also a string. Then I'm going to uh, tell VBA what folder constitutes our source folder. So I'm going to go into the statements folder. I'm going to right click on one of the files, go to properties, and I'm going to copy this location. It needs to go in quotation marks. And I'm going to put that final uh, backslash at the end of the path. Then I'm going to define the destination folder. And again, it goes in quotation marks. I'll paste in the same uh, path and I'll just change the backup, uh, the folder name rather to backup. And there we are. I've declared and defined my two variables. To copy the file, I'm going to use the function file copy. And you'll see that that has two arguments, source a string, destination a string. So what we can do is we can say our destination is our source folder, but you also need to give the name of the file. So I'm going to use the ampersand symbol to concatenate the path with the name of my file, which is April 2018 dot XLSX comma, and then I need to give the destination path. So that's going to be a destination folder ampersand. And what I'm going to do is actually rename the file when it's copied. So it's going to be called backup underscore April 2018.xlsx. Okay, and that completes the file copy function. So let's see if it actually works. So I'm watching my little folders over here. At the moment, I've just got a file icon in the statements folder. I'm looking to see one appear in the backup folder. So I'm going to press play, and you can see that the file has been copied to the backup folder. If I open it up, you can see it's also been renamed as backup April 2018. Okay, that's all there is to it. Copying a workbook from one folder to another using the file copy function in Excel VBA. Thanks very much for listening. It's been Chester Tugwell at Blue Pecan Computer Training.